my guy just reached my destination. Hopefully going to start the walk in the next couple of minutes. 10 peak challenge guys. So guys, going up the first one, God it's hot and yes I'm struggling, it's usually the case when you start hiking the first hour, it's sort of tough, but once your legs sort of get used to that motion, you're then alright, so that's the climb up there to Barrow. We'll be really exact. How many metres is this one? It's Barrow isn't it? 450 metres. First come first first peak complete guys. So we've got alpha size, we've got corsi pipe, we've got scar crank, sail, uh, crack hill at the back, and grass north behind there, one down to the left. We go down the dip, over to poke your head, rise out pipe, and then we come down the whole track. Oh my god, sounds crazy this. <laughs> 10 peak challenge. Oh. <sighs> Drop that backpack, eh? Feels good. 23 minutes, 0.75 miles. Hopefully, we're gonna go up to. Outer side. Outer side, that's up there. Climbing up the second one. Luckily, we don't have our backpacks, but I don't know why it still feels so hard. <laughs> Maybe because it's uphill along this little trail and all the way up there. That's number two, guys. This is peak number two, outer side. And we've got another eight more to go. Gonna be a long day today, guys. I just love the greenery. It gives me peace in my soul, body and mind. Very good for your mental health, guys. Getting out in the fresh air and open. And no backpack feels amazing, <laughs> doesn't it? <laughs> I know. We are going wee 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 and there's the summit. <laughs> How many steps have we done? 10,000 steps. So, yeah. <laughs> I think it did, you know, but I was too busy eating, weren't I? <laughs>
the fourth one is. Wow guys, look at that zigzag path. That looks pretty mad. Can you imagine like a bike rider coming down that? Wow, that'd be pretty incredible. So I always sort of uh, have a bladder bag because it is easier to hydrate yourself. Sips of water, because if you don't have enough water, you could possibly get muscle cramps which could stop you sort of continuing your journey. So hydration is key, guys. That's it, marathon runner. <laughs> Leading the way. <laughs> so the guy at the front there, he's actually going to complete half a marathon in September. So he's sort of here to train as well. So yeah, look at that. and everything going on here. Hey, do some digging. Well, I'm volunteering to maintain the path. Fantastic, oh wow, that's great. So guys, number five summit, sail. So guys, that's the next climb for the sixth mountain that we're gonna go. And there's the summit. Oh God, looks so scary. So just a bit of scrambling as well. Not just a hike, <laughs> it's a uh, pretty, pretty stony. And there's more climbing. Oh, help me. There's a saying, ain't there, that the best, the best views are the toughest climbs. Oh my God, it's very much true, isn't it? Because you could not see this from down there. Yeah. Paragliding off this mountain, wow. Now that would be something to do. Number six. What's this one called? So this has got two names. It's either Crag Hill yep. or Eel Crag. Eel Crag Eel or Crag, Crag Hill. Wow. It's not a hill, so it's not a crag. Yeah. Can you see them clouds up there? Does that mean by the time we get to number eight, nine, we're going to be in clouds? Possibly, yeah. Yeah, because that looks quite bad, that, that side, doesn't it?
Yeah. Ah. Uh. Got one to complete there first. Let's conquer this number seven one first, then we'll think about the next one. <laughs> yes, mate. Number seven. What's this one called? One dope. So guys, we're currently walking up to number eight, but that one is number nine, and that, including this climb, is the toughest from Mall. So yeah, the amount of stones, I just can't comprehend. Number eight for this one. Oh, oh, and look at me, I got excited as well. Okay, so where are oh, look at them bees. So, where's the next one? Ah, ah. And then we sort of are we coming back on ourselves to go to number nine? Right, yeah. Yeah, definitely need the muscles for that. Oh, this is amazing. That was quite a struggle, but it was good that, wasn't it? Really pushing your body to its limits. See the clouds, guys, look at that. Number nine, that one there, and then number 10, and then finish. And then a spa, I need a hot tub. <laughs> Don't be saying that. Like a bonus, bonus, bonus sunny day. <laughs> He said it, this is the big one. <sighs> did, we, we, did we go to that one up there? We did? Oh wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wow. Wow, that's... That one, that one, and that one. And then that one. Wow, that's incredible guys. going guys remember to move forward never look back always move forward we have done 4223 feet of ascent which is a lot more than Ben Nevis wow so we have done a lot of climbing today yeah a little bit more to do yeah 
nearly done now we're nearly there it's a little bit more of a push and then happy days i'm not even joking just come and have a look Still got a little bit of time to get to the car yet. <laughs> it's still not over, is it? Yeah. You're saying this now, it's going to be tough when we get down there. But we've done the hard bit. sort of the challenging bits really is sort of coming down these stones because you can't one wrong move you know you're injured that's it that sort of stops everything so it's quite important that you go slow but I love it I love scrambling I think it gives me a thrill but yeah I'm gonna continue to the end of that bit and then that's the walk straight down back to the car so guys we're towards the end of the walk now i think another half an hour back to the car and it's exactly 10 hours so yeah the average i think is about seven to eight but uh, to be honest we took our time so that's 10 hours for 10 peaks Woo! that's a good going isn't it my legs are aching though <laughs> So are yours, Pam, aren't they? Yeah. Don't you jelly? <laughs> jelly legs. <laughs> and we hopefully around that bend take a right down to the car. Well, I finished the walk. I hope not. Maybe even thousands. I hope not. Because <laughs> I've got to edit these now and there's gonna be no, I've got a good few shots though. So we started at to... quarter past nine. Seven now. How many miles have we done? It's the only watch. 12.2 miles. Yeah. 9 hours 52. The important bit, the ascent. Yep. Total ascent, 5,066 foot. Wow. That's definitely more than the Scarfell, Ben Nevis and everything put together. So no, it's about 1,700 metres, so yeah. it's, it's a lot higher than Ben Nevis. Yeah, wow. Which is 14, like 1,300. 13. We've done a lot today. Yeah. That's it guys, and look, we've come to the finish line. Come on guys, we're done.